Hello friend, in this video lecture, I am going to show that root 3 cos x 20 minus x 20 equal to 4. So here, first I am going to take the LHS left hand side in LHS root 3 cos x 20 minus x 20. So we can write root 3 cos x 20, we can write 1 by sin. 20 minus sec we can write cos 20 now here we can take the LCM sin 20 and cos 20 so the LCM came sin 20 cos 20 is the LCM sin 20 divide with this all cos 20 come cos 20 multiply with so here root 3 cos 20 and cos 20 going to divide with this all sin 20 comes sin 20 multiply with 1 so here this comes sin 20 now here after so here I am going to write root 3 2 divide with up and down so root 3 by 2 cos 20 minus 1 by 2 sin 20 so here I divide 2 so going to use 2 up so if I take the LCM 2 2 by 2 it comes so it will cancel now here we can write sin 20 cos 20 and hereafter you already know sin 60 equal to root 3 by 2 and uh, cos 60 equal to 1 by 2 so going to make that in the form of sin a minus b sin a into cos b minus cos a into sin b so we can write here sin 60 into cos 20 minus cos 60 sin 20 now here sin 20 cos 20 so here you already know about the formula sin a minus b equal to sin a into cos b minus cos a into sin b so here sin uh, 60 minus 20 we can write sin 60 into cos 20 minus cos 60 into sin 20 okay this thing we need to use so here we can write 2 sin for all this we can write sin 60 minus 20 and here sin or uh, 20 is there and cos 20 so here 2 sin 40 and uh, sin 20 cos 20 so here going to multiply 2 so 2 sin 40 is there multiply 2 up and down numerator and denominator so here it comes sin 20 cos 20 ok so here sin 2a equal to 2 sin a into cos a the same thing 2 sin a into cos a degree is the same 20 20 so we can write 2 into 2 sin 40 2 sin into cos a sin 2a sin 2 into 20 so here this come 4 sin 40 and in down sin 40 sin sin that cancel it come 4 so here we need to you uh, uh, we need to make the RHS LHS equal to 4 okay 
so here we can write LHS equal to RHS equal to 4 it's a proof so this is the important IIT question that ask so you need to remember the formula cos a minus b cos a plus b sin a plus b sin a minus b to sin a into cos a after that you can easily solve this kind of question so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you